Good morning, Math 9 Prep. This is your last Keep Forever for Book 6. I'm so proud of you for getting this far. And you're almost done. So, Book 6.5 has two options for this solve. And this is the first example that I've written in your book. So, I'll just walk through it with you. Option 1, and I think that's the way you'll use, is we've got 5 times this stuff. So if I do the opposite, it would be divide by 5 on both sides. And this looks big, but it's okay. We'll just do it on the side. We can do 355 divided by 5. So 5 goes into 35 7 times. 5 times 7 is 35. Subtract. We're left with 0. Bring down the 5. 5 goes into 5 1 time, and 1 times 5 is 5, subtract, and we're left with a remainder of 0. So it goes in exactly 71 times. So then I'm left with 5 plus 6x equals 71. Then it looks like something we've done before. So take away 5, take away 5. 6x equals 71, take away 5, x, divide by 6, divide by 6, and x equals 11. And now we'll verify. So verify works the same as always. Rewrite, replace, redo. So rewrite our original equation always. 5, I'm just going to slide this up for you. 5 bracket. 5 plus 6x is supposed to equal 355. 5 times 5 plus 6 times 11 in brackets equals 655, supposedly. 5 times 5 plus 66 equals, or supposed to equal, 355. And remember, we're just doing each side separately as we go down, thinking just about that side. So 5 times 5 plus 66 is 71. It's supposed to equal 355. And 355 does equal 355. So we know we're right. Hooray! Okay, option two. And I want to show you this one because we will use this coming up, but probably I would stick with this method one, so just watch this one and keep it in your mind. Option two is to multiply in this 5 to both terms first. So we would have 25 plus 30x is supposed to, or does equal, sorry, 355. And take away 25, take away 25, 30x equals um, 355, take away 25. Well, if it was 350, take away 25, I would have 325, and I've got actually 5 more, so 330. Divide by 30, divide by 30. And x equals 11. Then our verify on this side would look identical. So notice, I think here you get rid of your big number to start with and work with something smaller. Versus here we keep that bigger number and work with it later. So your choice, if you love this more, then go ahead. I do think this is probably going to be easiest. So let's do one more. Um, let's do number 5 off this page. So, 2 bracket 8 plus 3x equals 22. And let's do it using method 1. So, 2 times 18, or sorry, divide by 2, divide by 2. Remember, this is your best friend's dad and three friends and then you and then we got this extra two so we're going to get rid of that extra two to begin with and then we just have the water ski analogy 
So one step and we're back to something we're really familiar with. Take away 8, take away 8, 3x equals 3, divide by 3, divide by 3, and x equals 1. And let's verify. So verify. 2 bracket 8 plus 3x equals 22. And now substitute 2 bracket 8 plus 3 times 1. And a bracket is supposed to equal 22. 2 bracket 8 plus 3 is supposed to equal 22. And 2 times 11 is supposed to equal 22. 2 times 11 does equal 22. So we know we're right. Yay! That's as hard as it gets. So I think you'll be fantastic at this, and you will love it. Congratulations! 6.6 .6 is a mix of everything, and it just gets you practiced up for the final test in the solving equations. And now you're awesome, and you can do absolutely any solving equations that they give you for the rest of your math life. So keep going. I'm so proud of you.